Hello everyone, my name is Loco, and welcome to a new video. Today I actually have a little bit of a different kind of video. Because today, as you might have already seen, we're going to have a look at my desk, my workspace, my kind of setup video, um, and stuff that I use to make the YouTubes and the live streams and all the other kind of stuff. So as you can see, I went with kind of like a green, um, green, black, white, silver kind of setup, and I have to say, I think, you, you know, I think you can be honest, it looks pretty damn sexy. So first off, my keyboard. This is the Razer Tournament Stealth Edition, and it's probably the best keyboard that I have ever used. It has cherry brown mechanical switches, and as you can see, it is tankyless, which means it's very compact, it looks very sexy, and I definitely like how I can move my mouse and my keyboard quite closely together. Next up, we have my mouse. This is a Death Adder 2013, and it's probably the best mouse that I personally have ever used. Fits right into my hand. And this is the mousepad that I use in combination with it. It's a Goliath to Speed Alpha Edition. Really love this setup. This is the Logitech C920 that I've been using for over the last year or so. Pretty damn satisfied with this one. It's perfect for live streaming and I think it's cool for the YouTubes as well. Next up, we have the Razer Bungie. This is actually a little bit of a mouse bungee where I have my mouse cord right there. And as you can see, it uh, prevents drag and it's just a little bit nicer. The Razer Mores is usually what I use when I make YouTube videos, but I also tend out to switch uh, headphones all the time. So, you know, I tend to use those mostly when I'm live streaming and making the YouTubes. And of course, the microphone that I use. This is actually the one that I'm currently talking into. It is a blue Yeti microphone and it's probably the best USB microphone that is out there. I know there's a few competitors that make very very good stuff as well but this is by far the best microphone that I have ever used. That is quite easy to use as well. Uh, you don't need any fancy setup for it. You just plug it into your PC and as you might hear it sounds pretty damn good so I'm definitely going to be sticking with this one for quite some time. So this is my actual system, as you can see it has fancy blue LEDs and all that kind of stuff and in general I'm pretty damn satisfied with this machine. If you want more details on my thoughts on every single aspect of the hardware, check out the link in the description of this video and it will take you right there. Um, this is in general, it's a pretty good setup, it's an i5-3570K at 4.2GHz uh, with a side shuriken um, cooler on top of it. Now we have 8 gigs of RAM and an M4, 128 gigs of SSD hard drive and a terabyte hard drive as well, as well as an XFX um, 6870, which I use as a graphics card, which is pretty damn cool. And as you can see, the front door of the system opens up, where it pretty much gives you access to a whole lot of dust, but also to some, <laughs> to some buttons that you can press to turn on the system. In general, I am super satisfied with my system. The first change that I would probably make is um, going to be the graphics card, since that's quite outdated. But considering the games that I currently play, it is really not that necessary. So I'm probably going to be sticking around for quite some time. Now this is not something that you would consider like top of top of the top of the line. Uh, but it is a pretty decent system, so if you're looking into doing something similar like I do right now with the live streaming and the YouTube and all that kind of stuff, this is definitely a system that I would recommend you go for or aim for or whatever. Um, how I usually go about setting up my system, I actually bought this system about two years ago, two, three years ago, and I basically replaced every part since then besides the case um, and the power supply. But I don't think any original part is really left from it, so I like updating everything um, you know, as I go, when new stuff gets released, and uh, hopefully you enjoyed this little video. If you did, please hit the like button, and as always, you can also leave a comment, and I will read every single one of them. Thanks for tuning in, everyone. Bye! It's something that my manly brain, or my somewhat manly brain, can't comprehend, but it looks like we got a Zerg versus Tyrant on the map, Nuker Procent TF.